While out on a job, Jack the plumber sees his customer Steve is frustrated and in a hurry. Steve wants his sewer clog fixed right away, so Jack gets to work. He's trying to determine if the clogs inside or outside the house when Steve impatiently asks why it even matters. Because, says Jack, if the clog's in the inside piping, I'll clean it no problem. But if it's outside the house, in your sewer line going to the main line, then it could be tree roots or possibly a natural gas pipe accidentally bored through your line when it was installed using trenchless technology. Gas lines are often installed near sewer laterals and mains. Sometimes they may be accidentally installed through a sewer line. It's a hazardous situation for anyone attempting to clear a resulting clog. But power equipment used to fix a clog sewer could very likely damage the gas line, producing a serious gas leak. Your house could fill up with natural gas, creating an unsafe situation. Whoa, says Steve. I had no idea it could be that serious. Now, he suddenly gives Jack all the time he needs to get the work done. But wait, says Steve, I'm not a gas customer. Jack replies, it doesn't matter. The intersecting gas line could be caused by a natural gas main near the street serving others in the neighborhood. Jack gets back to work and determines the clog is outside Steve's home. He uses an inline sewer camera to inspect the sewer line. During the inspection, the plumber sees there is a natural gas pipe in the sewer and immediately calls the gas utility to come out. The gas utility technician arrives and confirms the problem is a crossbore, a natural gas line installed through the sewer line that needs to be corrected by the gas utility. He commends Jack for calling the gas utility right away and reiterates how dangerous the situation could have been had the gas utility not been called. You know, Steve, says the technician, if you would have tried to fix this yourself or if your plumber was in a hurry and not careful, the gas line could have been damaged, creating a gas leak. Natural gas is flammable, and a simple spark can start a fire or other serious incident. The technician hands Steve a safety brochure, which lists the signs of a natural gas leak. Things like hissing sounds, natural gas odor, bubbles rising in standing water, possibly in the toilet. If you do suspect a leak, explains the technician, everyone should leave the area immediately and get a safe distance away. Do not turn on or off any electrical devices or do anything that might cause a spark. Call 911 and then the gas company as soon as you're safely out of the area. Steve can't thank Jack the plumber enough for handling the problem safely. He feels much better knowing the crossbore is gone and his sewer is flowing fine. Plumbers, be on the lookout. Before doing any work on a sewer lateral, determine first where the clog is located. If it's outside the footprint of the house, don't assume it's tree roots. It may be a natural gas line. If available, use a camera to inspect the sewer lines for the presence of a natural gas line. If a natural gas line is found, call your local gas utility or local one-call center before attempting any sewer work.